Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome to Jared Gaming. Welcome to Chain, which stands for Chronological Haunted Anomalous Interconnected Narrative. This is a collaboration of developers, 20 games, 20 developers. Um, I just heard about it recently and I'm really itching to see um, what is in here. These collaborations oftentimes um, bear some really, really interesting and unique games. So let's just dive straight in and see what we have in store for us. Ooh. Oh, we have an old CD sleeve. Oh, I like that. Oh, it's so cool. We'll go in order, depending on how long these are, because I have no idea. I've, I imagine 20 games, they're probably not very long, but who knows. I may do more than one, I don't know. At the start of this video, I have no idea how long any of these games are, so let's just get into the first one. This is Torch by Jazz Mikkel. Ooh, let's play it. Insert that disc. It's spinning the wrong way, there it goes. <laughs> My god. Oh my god, what are we? We have a torch, and that's the name of the game. I don't know the controls. Is it just, um, it looks like it's just walking so far. Very odd. We're exploring, perhaps? Some sort of, oh great, is this a maze? I hope it's not a maze. Mazes are not amazing. Hearing some strange sounds though. I don't, at the moment at least, I do not have a run option, so that's good. But who are we? Where are we? What are we doing? Is this our job? Or are we s somehow find our way in here mysteriously? There's new context. I need story. This place sounds like it's crawling with bugs, but yet I do not see anything. It's fine with me. Hello? Is anyone here? Is this a tomb? Is it a cave? It's kind of hard to tell. Get that feeling that the game is lulling us. Oh, yep, I was right. Game is lulling us into something, and we have found. No! Ooh. Is this normal? <laughs> I don't like this ride. I wish to be off of it. I guess we go forward. Why not, right? Was that it? Interesting. Hmm. I wonder if this is like... Every game tells another, another part of the story? That actually sounds a lot like what I've been told. Interesting. Let's, um... Let's go to the next one. Specimen number two. The torch is still there. Interesting. Mrs. Blanche. By Adam Pipe and Victor Kraus. Okay. Let's get into it. We're definitely doing more than one then. What are we? Where are we now? Is this a continu this must be a continuation then? Ooh. Whoa. Oh, this is different. Hi. Is that G-Man from Half-Life. <laughs> Hello? Ah, Mrs. Blanche. Glad to see you've made it this far. My apologies for us having to meet in this way. I'm sure you understand that these circumstances require more elaborate route. However, I'm sure you're pleased to hear that two of the other participants have made it beyond this point. That's right. This isn't quite the end of the road yet. Do you know what beach we are on, Mrs. Blanche? Have a look around, see if you can find a landmark. That's right, it's endless beach. All the way. You'll find that this beach, in a certain way, doesn't really exist. In fact, after you step through that gate, you were transported to a place that's personal to you. It does all feel rather familiar, doesn't it? In this as it may be, there is a way forward. I don't think you're going to need that torch, I assure you. Stick close to me and hold your breath. You'll be fine. But I would like to keep my torch. Okay, here we go. I guess I'm following him. Right? Yeah, okay. I, um, okay. Well, here we go under the water. 
This is very weird. We still got the torch. It's not lit. Obviously, we're underwater, but... Very, very strange this is. Why are we here? What are we doing? Who is this man? He glows slightly. <laughs> Which is helpful, since we're going to the bottom of the ocean, apparently. Slightly unnerving. Just because it's so... It's so peculiar. It's so odd. There's nothing, nothing all over the place. Where are we going? Who are you? Are you God? An angel? A devil? A demon? What is your story? Why are we here? How come we can hold our breath for forever, it would seem? We are definitely not in the land of the living. Nice of him to wait for us, though. <laughs> he could just take off. He walks faster than we do. Oh, are we going deeper? Going deeper and deeper into this abyss. Ugh, I don't like water as it is. This is just strange. It does feel like he's getting further and further ahead of us. It's getting much darker, too, as we go deeper 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 into this watery depths oh we're, we've reached something what what it was a rock <laughs> it was hard to tell it did not look like a rock but at least it's something different more rocks getting a little bit seen a little bit more that's nice better than just flatness how much further sir how much further oh Oh, okay, he's just going to make a run for it. You led me down. Oh! Oh! East Ort! And... Okay, that is not great. Why did he leave us? Why did he leave us? What a dick. Next disc, please. Specimen number three, the participants. Assigned researchers... Z underscore Bill and Dwindin if I guess I am not sure. Let's load it up and see what's next on a strange and mysterious journey that we find ourselves on. Far under the sea, or high in the clouds, it is a strange place I have found myself the keeper of. We currently have three successful participants enrolled here. Where is here? Whoa! Are we the dude now in the suit? Press two arrows to walk. Oh. Interesting. Very interesting. Can we go back the way we came? Oh, we can, sort of. But I don't know. Yeah. What is that? Oh. Mrs. Blanche. Oh. We didn't make it. I favor her very much. She may look dead, but in actuality, she is fighting through a mindscape of her own creation. Will she awaken from her test? What the freaking heck? Give me that torch! I told her she wouldn't need this torch. Yeah, you told her so. Good job, dude. I mean, it's nice to think that he took off without her, but then kind of came back to see if she was okay. Oh. Ooh. I managed to break down the boards with the torch. Oh, we took the torch with us. Okay. Did not realize that was the case. Oh. You're diving off the coast of Canada. It's as strange as you remember, it's cold, and you're an idiot creature not designed for an ocean. You just sort of float along, and it's suddenly dark. You have a light, but you can barely see anything, until the beam clips something close, something huge, and moving incredibly fast, it's like standing next to a train as it rockets past. A train? In, in the ocean? And later you dream about it. You're going about your day, and you see it in the corner of your eye. It's immense. And so much faster than you remember. You try to move, but you just hang there, floating, waiting for it to finally take you. What in the actual hell? Oh! Ha! Whoa! What am I doing? Dodge! Oh! We did not dodge. I didn't know we were going to have to combat. Bring it. Dodge! Ha ha! Dodging you! 
piece of crap monster stamina! Attack! How do I attack? Oh, space! <laughs> I couldn't read it, it's too fast. Get out of here, you freaking train monster! Whatever the, what the... This is freaking weird. This is very weird, and I... I find myself rather enjoying it. I enjoy weird things, it would seem. Okay, off we go on our weird little trip through the bottom of the ocean, fighting strange train monsters. Nothing weird about that, right? Oh, it's... Well, okay, we're somewhere else now. Level three of something. We have entered the cheese realm. Level one? Why does this keep getting locked? I do not have an answer for you, mysterious suited man. Level two, it is not locked. You don't really see them when you're well, but get sick or start to stumble, and you'll find the vultures of every kind, birds, dogs, other people, just hovering at the horizon and waiting for you to finally sit down and give up. If you close your eyes, you can hear them inching closer and closer. It's like those stories you hear about old people dying in their apartments and their own cats eating them. Same thing. Vultures. Oh, oh, a vulture! A vulture! No! Eh! Oh, vulture. Bad. It's got weird hand arm thing. I'll dodge you and then I'll kill you, you stupid freaking thing. This is weird. Nope. Oh, he eviscerated me. No good. I'm way faster than you, you freaking bird monster weird thing. Eat it. Oh, we eviscerated you. You are now a puddle of bird paste. This is so bizarre. This is where I left participant number two. Where have they gone? Your guess is as good as mine, dude. I have no idea what's going on. Uh-oh. That's a lot of blood. I think we found participant number two. What are you? Ooh. I think this shiny emblem belonged to participant number two. Great. So glad we have it now. Do I return it? I think we do. I hold up the emblem. Even wrapped in dreams, participant number two is drawn to it. I see them flying high in the distance. They will be fine. Oh, there they go. Hi. Am I supposed to do something with you? Oh, I guess not. No, stop. Can I? Okay, participant number two is doing fine, apparently. Whatever that means. Ooh, what's this? A gun. Where did this come from? I don't know, but now we have a gun. Neat. Oh, this place seems to have changed a bit. It's like we're coming closer into reality. Oh. I need to check in on the other participants. Well, okay. Let's do that, then. Or maybe I can use the gun to shoot the lock on this door? Yep. I won't have to worry about that lock anymore. Show to who's boss. Yeah. Oh, red world and some trees in it. None of it is good, though. Oh, good, a monster. Hi! Oh, God. Oh! Are you participant number one? I'm your friend! I made you and I can destroy you! Oh, targeting. Stay on target. Ooh, headshot. <laughs> Got him. Okay. Bye. Oh, I don't, don't know who we just destroyed, but... I think it was participant number one. Uh-oh. Oh, it's getting fuzzy. It's getting grainy. What do I do? I killed a participant. So that's it. My backwards masters will be phasing me out of existence. I feel it happening now. For some reason, my final thoughts turn to Miss Blanche. Has she woken up? I don't know, it's too weird. It's too weird, what is going on? What is going on? Oh, oh man. This is, this is, this is trippy and wild and this is so freaking cool. I'm really digging this so far. Let's do another one. Ooh, specimen number four. Emerge. Assigned researchers David Rod Mad. He's a mad lad. Alright, let's load it up and see what it's all about. Very intriguing. Miss Blanche, will she awaken from her test? Oh my. Oh my. Oh. There we are, Miss Blanche, underwater. <gasps> oh, 
Wow! Holy moly. Oh, this is really interesting looking. Hi, is that me? Do I do anything? Am I just looking at myself? Or that's just another person? Okay, bye. All the other people who did make it? Uh, oh, what's happening? Woof. It's weird looking. Weird old textures. What is happening? Oh. We just like warped through. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Every new game that we try is more and more strange and confusing, but I still find myself intrigued by it endlessly. I love it. I don't know why. The strangeness. Hi. Don't get close. Okay. <laughs> you don't have to tell me more than once. What about you? A lever? I'll use it. Drain it. Ooh. Ooh, it's so cool looking. Ooh, that I part the sea like Moses? The fishes are still floating, though. Wait, those are not fishes, those are dead people. Never mind! Ooh. This is very cool. Very, very cool. Oh, okay. I love this. I just love the retro. Oh, another person. Uh, it's, uh, oh, um, there's a thing at your feet. What's happening? What did you do? Oh. Don't get close. Are they... Are, are they telling me not to get close? Or am I not supposed to be getting close to these guys? I don't know. I don't know which way to go, but I'm going to go this way. It seems more interesting to go deeper into this... Whatever this is. A doorway... To where? Ooh, I don't know. A sphincter? Oh! Oh! -ho! <laughs> what is going on? Hi! Did I get close? I didn't mean to. If I wasn't supposed to. Crush? I am now the perspective of the giant one, apparently, and I'm going to just crush this little thing. Okay, bye. What the f- <laughs> What in the world? Oh my gosh. This is so weird. I adore this game so much. Or series of games or whatever this is supposed to be. Pass the test. Gladly. What? What in the world? Alright. I'm gonna do one more. I'm gonna do one more. Because this is really interesting. I I will play all of these, but for now I think I'll do one more and call it good. Let's see what we have here. Drip. Specimen number five. Assigned researchers Coulter Waymeyer and Bill Detta. I apologize to every name that I've butchered in this so far. If you're watching, I, I sincerely apologize. I love your games, though. <laughs> it's really cool. Let's check out Drip. Load her up. Rated S for spooky. Congratulations. You aced the test. Ha! That scary place is far away. Miss Blanche will take you home now. Just stay right there. Congratulations! Oh my god, what's happening? Uh. Oh. Use was to go- what? Oh, 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 what am I- am I supposed to collect collecting these? Press space to jump, press again to hover. What the freaking heck? Oh, what? Uh, uh, this... Okay, this is trippy. I don't know what... Oh, this is weird. I don't know. Am I supposed to be collecting as many as I can? I don't think I'm doing a very good job. Whatever is happening. You shouldn't go down there, but I can... Miss Blanche will be very upset. I have no choice. Where else am I supposed to go? 
all this testing will have been for nothing. I'm not trying to go down wherever we're not supposed to be going down. I don't really have much control here. I'm just kind of going with the flow. Oh my gosh. I am beyond, beyond confused at this point. You're too cute, really. Am I? Why, thanks. Collecting those little things. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. As if they meant anything. Don't they? You'll never wake up. I wish to. This is really weird. Uh-oh, not when you're so seduced by sleep. I've got nowhere else to go but to... Okay, guys, well, that's where I'm going to end this video. I think five is a good amount. That leaves us room to do some more later on, but I am super intrigued by this. This is very weird. I don't have better words to describe it. It's very strange. It feels weird playing it, even. Like, I am. There's so unknown still to be had that I have nothing to really even make sense of. It's very interesting and I can't wait to play more and I hope that you guys have enjoyed this. If you had, please leave a like and a comment. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And as always, thank you so very much for watching. You've been awesome. Let's play again soon and I'll see you in the next video.